So we're going to talk about weight gain in a breastfed baby. How do I know my baby is getting enough milk? Um, it's very, very hard to know uh, in a world where we like to measure everything and we like to see how much they're getting. Well, with breastfeeding, we can't. So there are some key things we can monitor to check that everything's going in the right direction. Um, the first thing we can do is to make sure they have got a good latch. Um, and so when I say good latch, we want to hear swallowing with the sound. We want to see swallowing either via their throat or when they drop their jaw uh, to drink, there'll be a pause before they close it again. And that pause is the mouth filling up with milk. And so if you see that pause, if you hear or see the swallowing, that's a great sign. We know they're drinking at the breast. If they don't uh, seem to be swallowing, uh, then that is something we need to address. And that's normally just a latch issue and it can be how you're positioning the baby or uh, it could be something anatomical in their mouth. But all of those things are rectifiable. And so it's important if you think you've got a problem that we get it sorted out. Key things to spot then. So we know we've got a good latch. We're working with a good latch. So key ways to know your baby is getting enough milk. You would want your baby to be feeding uh, between 8 and 12 times in a 24 hour period and some babies feed more but certainly minimum of 8. That will help you to build a really good supply um, but it was also the amount of times a baby should be feeding and somewhere between 10 and 12 is best and you may find like many babies they feed 12, 13, 14 times. By the time they are 10 to 14 days old you want them to have regained their birth weight another good sign that things are heading in that correct direction. Um, diapers are a fantastic way to know whether the baby is drinking at the breast. So you're going to want to see uh, around six, maybe five to six wet diapers in a 24 hour period and you're going to want around three poopy diapers in a 24 hour period. And that's going to be a great sign that food is going in because stuff's coming out. Um, Weight gain. Um, so from 0 to 3 months, you would want to see around 110 to 200 grams per week. Now you see that's quite a large range. So don't worry if your baby's not at the top range, as long as they're falling somewhere between the 110 to 200 grams uh, in it per week, then, then we're going to be in the right zone. And then when they get to around four to six months, that number's going to drop. Breastfed babies' numbers slow down dramatically at four months, their growth. Um, and you're going to want to see around 110 to 140 grams per week from around uh, four to six months old. Other ways you can tell your baby's getting enough uh, at the breast is do they have good skin colour? Is their skin firm and not sunken or wrinkly? Um, which means they're getting enough fluid. Um, are, is their head circumference growing? Is their length growing? It's not just about weight. Weight is one measurement of a growing baby. Other measurements are head circumference, length. Are they meeting milestones? Are they doing what you'd expect them to be doing at the time they're meant to be doing it? These are great indicators your baby is growing and, and, and doing well. Um, so I hope that helps. I hope that gives you a good idea of what to look for. Uh, when you're worrying about how much your baby's drinking. And remember with regards to percentiles, it's important to remember percentile is one measurement of, of how a baby overall is doing. And um, we'll talk about that in another video, but um, if your baby is not above the 50s or is down in the 20s or whatever, that doesn't matter. Um, so long as they are tracking their growth, not plummeting at any stage, then, then they are fine, that's probably just them. But I have a different video on percentiles, so if you're interested in that, please check it out.